Hey guys, welcome back. New week, new video. And today I'm going to share with you the new update of the Golden Cannon Grid. Let's go. So first of all, thank you so much to everyone. I've reached 10K in Dribble. Thanks a lot. Yes, that's a big, big milestone for me. And I really, really want to take a little time to thank you all for all your support during these years. I really wouldn't be here without you. All the agencies that hired me got to know me because of the followers I had and, and that made it easier for them to reach out and see me. So I'm really, really thankful for you guys because you've supported me all these years and it really means a lot. So as a way of thanking you, I prepared a version two of the Canon Grid. Um, a lot of people have been asking like, how, how about a sketch version? How about an illustrator, illustrator version? And uh, what about responsiveness? Um, so I've been taking a little bit of time and I prepared something super, super special for you guys. So let me show you. Here we have the golden Canon grid in all its splendor. Photoshop, Sketch, Illustrator, Adobe XD, SVG, PDF, EPS, PNG. You have like any type of format you want now. Big shout out to Luis Delgado for, for sending me the sketch file um, a while ago, like two weeks or three weeks after I posted the golden freebie. Um, so shout out to Luis Delgado. Thank you so much, man. You're a great sport. Uh, he sent it to me via email. I know there's people that have been posting versions in Dribble, but he sent it to me via email so that, so that I could share with you. So big shout out to you, man. Respect. Then I'm going to show you one, one more thing. Now it's responsive. So now you have 1920, 768, and 320. So desktop, tablet, mobile. Uh, and as you can see, this works super well in any format. Um, and if that's not enough, I made a library. So for you guys, if you don't know what a library is, you go to sketch, you open preferences and you click in the library tab, right? And you just press add library, you install the library and boom, that's it. Now you have a library. Now, what does that mean? It means that whenever you're designing something in your sketch, in sketch, you go to insert golden Canon grid free uh, library and you can access it, access it here and look, boom. Now I have a golden Canon grid right in my artboard. Now, if you're doing something like, let's say you're doing 1080 by 720 because you're doing a smaller like desktop version. Then you put the 1920, that is the closest one, and you just fit it. 1920, uh, 1080, sorry, by 720. Boom. And it just adapts perfectly well to any format. So bear that in mind. You can just squeeze it and it adapts perfectly and it has the same proportions that it had before. Um, so no changing of proportions, it, it fits perfectly well with any format. And I have, a, I have to apologize, guys, because I said this was the golden ratio grid when it was a golden cannon grid. Um, so sorry, I didn't mean, mean to mislead anyone. Um, I think this is still a, an awesome, awesome tool. So I wouldn't mind if it's a golden cannon grid or a golden ratio grid, as long as it creates great results. And that's been the, my experience. Like for me, this has created super awesome results and it's super flexible, so I love it. And I hope you can enjoy it too. And don't condemn me, don't condemn me. Be merciful. I'm, I'm just sharing a freebie for you guys. I'm sharing what I have in my hands. Whatever I have, I'm sharing it with you. So. Be kind, don't be harsh. Um, and good on you for the, for the ones who said, hey, this is not the golden ratio grid. Like, I, I don't see the golden ratio here. Um, because you helped me see 
something that I wasn't seeing. I, I thought, I really thought it, this was a golden rage grid. So thank you. And I have two notes. One is don't mistake sincerity for truth. We, we don't have to m make the mistake to say um, he must be right, he's so sincere, because you can be sincerely wrong, right? So don't mistake sincerity for truth. I am very sincere, but I can be wrong. Um, so that leads me to the second note, would, that would be don't be a follower, be a student. Um, take advice, but not orders. And make sure, and this is super important, make sure that what you do is a product of your own conclusion. Not to do what someone else tells you to do. Don't do what I tell you to do. I'm not giving you orders. I'm here to share my knowledge. So you have to be a, a student, study, ponder what I say, and then whatever makes sense for you, then apply it. Um, so that's it for today, guys. Hope you guys like this. I'm gonna leave the link below where you can download the file. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Let me know if you have any other requests. And I'm posting one video per week, so su subscribe, um, share, comment, like, and all the good stuff. And I will see you next week.